you look over there, you see the more common size of solar panel. Don't be afraid that it looks that terrible, because I did that, solder it together by myself. There are companies who are producing these full-size cells, and sometimes when they produce them, they break. And that's what you see here, these pieces are all broken. And the funny thing is that it doesn't matter if they are broken or not, they still are producing electricity. And each of these pieces is producing 1.5 volts. And the wattage depends on the size. So this one will produce much more watt than a small one or a broken one. And so you see what I did is here is just put them together. The sun shines on it and ions go through this silicon. So on the top you have minus and on the bottom you have plus. And so I grab the plus from the bottom and bring it here to the next one. So this is then the first 1.5 volts comes here, feeds in here. The next one has three volts. So it goes back there, comes out here again and you have 4.5 and you have six and so on. And in this way you go around and you add volt by volt. And at the end I want to have the 28 to 30 volts that I can feed my batteries because here we run the whole thing on batteries and this is feeding in the batteries with 20 volt, uh, uh, volts and the wattage is depending on how much sun is shining and how big the area is.